Hello again, this is Robert from Kapwing.com. We're a free content creation tool that allows you to edit photos and videos instantly online. All of the videos you see on our YouTube channel were made right on our website. Go check it out. Today I'm gonna to show you a very essential video editing tutorial on how to add a video in the middle of another video. So we'll take it over to the studio and see how it works. I'm here now in the Kapwing Studio Editor where I have a clip that I've already been working on, but this is the same clip that I wanna cut into two halves so that I can put another clip in the middle there. So I'll show you what I've uh, got so far here and then I'll show you how to add a new clip to the middle of this. Since I'm planning to get my YouTube channel off the ground soon, I've been looking into some professional video editing options. These prices are insane. I'm better off sticking with Kapwing, I think. So right after I say these prices are insane, I have another video clip that I wanna cut over to for a comedic effect. And I'm gonna show you right now how to do that. So first, let's duplicate this scene so that we have two of them. So up here in the top left-hand corner on the scene view, next to the trash can icon, you'll see a copy button. I'll click that and that's gonna make an exact copy of this scene. So now I know I wanna add another scene between the beginning and the end. So I'll click this add scene button here between my two scenes and it's gonna add a third blank scene. So now I can drag this blank scene between my two scenes and that's where the new video clip will go. So before I bring my new clip in, I'm gonna trim down each of the scenes I already have in my studio so that they're at the perfect length and they're ready to cut perfectly into my new clip. Since so I'm here, I'm gonna my... cut out the part where I say, I'm better off with Kapwing. Better off. I'm better off. I'm insane. Okay, so I cut it right after I say insane there, and I'm just using the trim tool on the right side here. Now on this clip, I want to trim it down so I say just I'm better off with Kapwing. Since I'm planning to get my YouTube channel off the ground, I'm better off sticking with Kapwing, I think. I'm better off sticking with Kapwing, I think. Perfect, so let's see what this looks like now. Since I'm planning to get my YouTube channel off the ground soon, I've been looking into some professional video editing options. These prices are insane. I'm so there it cuts to the white scene. That's where we're gonna I'm add a scene off in. sticking with Kapwing, I think. Since and I'm then it comes back to our third scene. So it looks like I need to trim a little more on this first scene. Since, Since I'm planning to get my YouTube are insane. Since I'm planning to get my YouTube channel off the... Okay. So now we're gonna add our new clip end. And I want to use a moment from the Netflix show Tiger King. And I've got that open here. So I've got a tweet here that has the moment I wanna use. And it's where he says, I'll never financially recover from this. So I'm just gonna click here to copy the link to that tweet. And then when I'm back in Kapwing on my blank scene, I can click upload and just paste that link in and it pulls the video right into Kapwing here. So there it is. We can see if it works. I am never gonna financially recover from this. Perfect, so it kind of plays into the joke I'm making about how expensive the software is. So now we've added this new scene in right in the middle here, and let's see how the whole thing looks. Since I'm planning to get my YouTube channel off the ground soon, I've been looking into some professional video editing options. These prices are insane. I am never going to financially recover from this. I'm better off sticking with Kapwing, I think. So that's perfect. I get the joke in there and it's um, kind of told in a way that I could never tell myself thanks to you know Joe Exotic here. So now that I'm done, I've added the new clip in between my other two clips. I've previewed the whole thing and make sure that it looks exactly how I wanted it to. I'll just click publish. And then from there, Kapwing's gonna kind of spin up its servers on the back end and put together that video for us. So let's jump ahead and see what it looks like when it's all done. So here our video is done processing and it's ready to view. Since I'm planning to get my YouTube channel off the ground soon, I've been looking into some professional video editing options. These prices are insane. I am never gonna financially recover from this. I'm better off sticking with Kapwing, I think. So that's perfect. I might even use this as an ad or something for our company. So 
That is how you cut a new clip into the middle of another video you're working on. It's very easy. You just need to make a new scene and put it right in the middle there. So if you found this tutorial helpful and you were able to you know, add this technique to one of your YouTube videos, please let me know in the comments down below. I'm always interested to hear how creators are implementing the advice and you know, taking away from these tutorials. So we're making new videos like this every day at this point. Please subscribe if you found this helpful and we'll be back soon with a lot more basic to advanced editing tutorials. I'm Robert from Kapwing and thanks for watching.